First Alert Weather with Brian Allworth is sponsored by St. Francis Healthcare System. It is Friday morning and for a change we do not have heavy showers and thunderstorms this morning. What we do have is some pretty thick fog, although this particular camera, the fog looking a little less dense than it was just a little while ago. Nonetheless, our fog, max, uh, fog maps, I'm trying to say, are still showing some pretty thick fog out there, so be aware of that. Lots of false echoes, uh, a strong inversion again this morning, but uh, the nearest rain is off to our southeast near Nashville, and it's moving away. Current temps are in the 50s and mostly 60s, so again, it's not that uncomfortable out there, but these temps are way above average for late September. You know, our average low now is creeping down into the low 50s in some areas, so yeah, no sign of fall. It's been interesting. Each it seems like each weekend forecast this month has been a little warmer. Usually we get gradually cooler and not this month. We've been slowly warming up and that looks to be the case for the upcoming weekend for sure. Now in terms of rain or thunderstorms, if you have outdoor plans, lots of festivals, games, that kind of thing going on, football games looks fine. It'll be quiet virtually no chance of any rain, let alone thunderstorms, but it will be unusually warm, almost hot for this time of year. Future cast, I'm gonna go ahead and really quickly go through the next couple of days. Occasional clouds, morning fog, tomorrow looking mostly sunny. Let's uh, check tomorrow night into Sunday. Again, a little fog Sunday morning, and then mostly sunny again on Sunday. The flow actually coming from east to west, which is a little unusual, but it'll stay dry and almost hot, really. For today, highs about 87, 88, 89, maybe 90 around Poplar Bluff and Kennett today, mostly sunny. Enough humidity for a bit of a heat index issue today. For tonight, upper 50s to low 60s, patchy fog again tomorrow morning. And yeah, check it out. Highs near 90 tomorrow and Sunday. That's an average high. But lows at least overnights with the humidity dropping a little bit. Fairly comfortable in the evening after sunset and in the morning early. So if you have stuff to get done outdoors, mornings and evenings might be okay. That's about the only thing that's fall like. But as we get into next week, it stays unusually warm and very, very dry. Next change, now this is a long way away, so a little asterisk here. This will likely shift a little bit with time as we get closer to it. But right now it's like about next Thursday, uh, a cold front on the way with a good chance of rain for a change and maybe some cooler weather as well.